all the learning and all the growth is in the slip ups. Mm-hmm. You know, that's. But when you're like, I just speaking as an alcoholic, they're shrouded in so much shame. Yeah. You know, they're horrible. Yeah. There's pain in there. Mm-hmm. And at the time, it's going to hurt, right? But if you embrace it and if you're prepared for it in many ways. So it's not something that we actively encourage, but we sort of slip it in there subtly because we lose too many people that will come along, do a challenge brilliantly well to day 20, slip up and disappear and go, mm-hmm. I failed. That's it. And I think when you're aimed in that middle ground, so we're not aimed at the dependent, you know, you can say to those people, look, don't use that as an excuse to give up. So you almost slip it in. We slip mm-hmm. it into some of the work that we do for the videos or the emails. So it's in the back of their mind that actually they might slip up. And if they do, there's great learning in there. And it's going to hurt and you're going to feel like you've failed and you've messed up. But there's so much growth in there because, as you said, you can find out ways to not slip up in the future. And suddenly then you do 30 days or 40 days or 90 days. And the whole world looks a lot different.